to the next story now and many a times it's considered a blessing to bring a newborn into the world and when a delivery takes place with mother and child both safe then the family is obviously joyful but for one family the birth of a child brought to light a condition the mother had that has left her bedridden for one year now here's the story of Ellie Bibiche the tears of a family that knows only too well the trauma they have had since Ellie Mukusa developed medical complications during her pregnancy last year. 17th of July 2013, Ellie Mukusa complained that she was unwell and was taken to the Aga Khan Hospital. I'm feeling dizzy, I have a headache, I have a blood, blood vision, I don't know what happened. And I talked to the doctor, the doctor said, no, this thing is not a problem, it is common. The then eight months pregnant mother was admitted at the hospital and was diagnosed with high blood pressure as well as diabetes. A day later, Ellie gave birth to baby Ethan through cesarean section, after which her health took a dive for the worse. And with it came a bloated hospital bill of six million shillings. But I say, how come now the thing is, the blood pressure is going up, down, up, down, up, down, it's not changed. I cannot understand. Now they say, okay. Better don't worry. A, a big challenge for us because we didn't have this, the six million. You know, no one plans for anyone to fall sick and suddenly you are asked to pay a bill of six million. The family says Ellie has been bedridden since then and her health condition is not only affecting them but also Ellie's only child, Ethan, who has never felt the embrace of his mother since birth. Ellie has been dependent on this feeding tube for nearly one year now and has daily prescriptions that the nurses here use to stabilize her. The nurses say she loves to sit in the sun. She responds to them using her reflexes and eye contact. Our prayer is to see that she talks again, she raises up from her bed and she's able to hold her baby. I think that will be our greatest joy to even see baby Ethan you know, being able to call mama who responds and talks to him. But for her mother, the plea is simple. I want to appone, I want to be able to give her an end. I want to be able to give her an end. I want to be The family has been able to offset part of the medical bill, but still say they cannot do it alone. An M-Pesa pay bill number, 316. 94 has since been opened to clear the 4 million shillings arrears owed to the hospital. In the meantime, baby Ethan plays with the family oblivious of the situation at hand.